the tape for this heavyweight fight. Well, how about the age discrepancy here? More than 15 years apart with big differences in height and reach. To get us started, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve LeVay. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. <laughs> This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Body out of Las Vegas, Nevada, El Diablo. And now to defeat his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, holding professional record on. 27 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Habiba the Eagle of Imagomeda. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long ready? time, and it is ready? gonna go down fight. right now. And at long last, we are underway here at the Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. That strike will count. Try to establish that jab. Nice punch by Nermago Medov. Knee to the liver, he's hurt bad. He didn't miss with that uppercut. And as he is, he looks to improve position here. Oh, there's a good shot from the bottom. Well, this is some serious pressure from the top by Nermago Medov. He's looking to take the back. Into full guard here. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw offense. Staying busy here. You like to see that, Joe. Back to the guard position. Well, you got to stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here. Nice punch. Back to half guard now. He lands a big shot from the bottom. Tried to move from half guard into side control. Denied. Let's go, guys. Work. Well, hard to win fights in mixed martial arts from the bottom, but nice work here in that position by Nurmago Medov. And he winds up on top. Trying to spin to the back. On his back. Just over three minutes to go. And he's back in the guard. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. Big punch from the bottom. That's a good shot from the bottom. Into half guard again. Back to full guard. Wow. He got tagged there. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Oh, nice job here staying busy off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Back to half guard. 
Big shot from the bottom. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. Past the two-minute mark in round one. Big punch from the bottom. Back to full guard, very nice. And he connects there. He postures into place. Work here from the bottom, Joe, as he tags him with that punch. All right, 60 seconds now to go in round one. Both fighters get up now. Looking to avoid that left hand. Oh, the oh, is shaking after that slam, Joe. Excellent movement on the ground here, always trying to better his position. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. He's moved back into side control. Keep it busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Oh, he's beating him up here. We got for the arm. We got for the arm. Horn sounds for the end of round one. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. What a great round. This fight is really shaping up. Jenny Andrade to get us going. with the jab there. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward. Combinations. Throw your punches and bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of it. Well, you got to be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. And he eats a right hand there. Posture's up. Half guard. Reversal here, nicely done. And he gets reversed. Trying to take the back here. Inside control once again. He's looking to work that mounted crucifix. Move back into side control once more. He's looking for the Kimura here in side control. What he wants to do here is he wants to pin his opponent's hand down. Then he wants to slide his arm underneath his opponent's, grab a hold of oh, And there it is! He set it up, it was beautiful technique, and he was forced to tap. Beautiful submission. Yeah, that is high-level grappling right there as he gets the win tonight here by way of submission. And he bided his time there. He stayed patient, 
waited for an opening, and then when it was there, he certainly capitalized to get the tap here tonight. And here's the end. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And one more time, nice technique here on this submission. So there he is, your winner by submission, and that's exactly how you put the rest of this division on notice. Looks like this guy could be a factor moving forward in this division. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 33 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by chop out due to a Kimura, so nearly 30 men have tried, and as yet, no one has solved the puzzle. That is the Dagestani Khabib Nurmagomedov proving to be, if not the best, one of the best lightweights in the world. And again, when the striking starts to catch up with the wrestling, this is a guy who is going to be even more dominant than he already is now. The Eagle, Khabib Nurmagomedov, getting his hand raised in a big way here tonight. Relax and not at you. You think you got it, we got it too. 